Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time checking out my channel, my name is Kylie and I am currently very pregnant, nine months pregnant with our first baby boy due any day now. My original due date was January 4th, 2021, but my doctors think I might be measuring a week ahead, so that kind of puts me at any day now. If we're going by my first due date, then I am currently 39 weeks pregnant and I am ready to get this baby out. If you guys have ever been pregnant, you know the feeling of being nine months pregnant and just uncomfortable, huge, everything hurts, and just ready to meet your baby. So that's definitely where I am, ready to get him out, ready to meet him and just start life with him. So as you can tell by the title, we are going to be trying all different kinds of things to be inducing my labor naturally. I've seen a lot of videos of people doing all different kinds of things to get labor started and progressing. So I'm gonna try out a few of those things. I'm definitely not gonna do all of them, but if you guys are interested in seeing me try out some of these different techniques and methods to get labor going, then definitely keep watching. Make sure to subscribe if you aren't already and give this video a thumbs up if you have been following along and you're ready to meet this baby as much as we are. If you're not caught up on all of my updates, at my last doctor's appointment, I was one and a half centimeters dilated and 50% effaced. So I'm definitely getting somewhere, definitely progressing. I've been having some mild cramping, definitely not anything that I would consider contractions. So I'm ready to get this labor kicked off, ready to do almost anything to get it started. Definitely not all of the crazy stuff. I'm not going to be doing castor oil. I've heard some crazy things about that. Definitely going to be trying out some different techniques and things that I have read will help get dilation going and get labor going. So this video is going to be a little different. It's going to be a little bit more vlog style because today is currently the 23rd of December. So I don't want to have a Christmas baby. If he came on Christmas, that would be great. I would still be so happy, but we'd like to make it past Christmas as much as possible. So I'm going to be doing a few things today a few things in the next couple days and then we'll probably really start doing some of these techniques on actual Christmas Day. That way he's born after Christmas. But I hope you guys enjoy the kind of more vlog style video. And if you guys are interested in seeing me try out some of these labor inducing techniques, then definitely keep watching. So the very first thing I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to go do some bouncing on my pregnancy ball that I got. I just got mine from Target. And I'm gonna make some raspberry leaf tea. I've heard that raspberry leaf tea is really good for your whole pregnancy, but in the third trimester, it can really help to kickstart your labor. So I'm going to go make a tea, do some bouncing on my ball, and I'll see you guys then. Okay, so like I said, the first thing I'm going to be doing is making a tea. So the raspberry leaf tea that I have is this pregnancy tea from the brand Traditional Medicinals. Um, and it's just their organic pregnancy tea that has raspberry leaf in it. So I'm going to make one of these. I have my Smeg tea kettle here and hopefully this kick starts something. Alrighty, I have my tea here all ready, so I'm going to let that steep for a little bit and then drink it all up and we'll see what it does. So update, it's a few days later. It is December 26th and it is officially past Christmas, so I can start doing all of the things to help get this labor going. We got some spicy food. I got some spicy Chick-fil-A sure sandwiches. Spicy food, but I know. Spicy. So I don't eat spicy food, like ever. So I'm hoping this will be spicy enough. If not, we might have to go spicier tomorrow, try something different. But I also did a mile walk today on the treadmill. I walked for the whole hour and I just did one mile and I have not been in this much pain the whole time. So there's a lot of pressure, a lot of pain. Hopefully this spicy chicken sandwich will help, but we shall see. I think I'm gonna make a, another pregnancy tea after eating. We'll see what happens.
January 1st, the first day of the new year. So happy new year when you guys are watching this. So far, none of the things that we've been doing have been working. So today we're going to do a few more things. We're gonna do some more walking. Maybe I'll go get some pineapple. I've heard pineapple um, can help induce labor. Um, we'll do some curb walking, which if you don't know what that is, I'll show you guys what that is, but it's just another easy way to start labor. So I was really hoping baby would be born today just because I feel like the first day of the new year is like such a cool day to be born and it would be 1-1-21, so that would have been so cool, but he wasn't wanting to come today, so that's okay. He will come when he's ready, but yeah, we're gonna do a few more things today and I'll bring you guys along. Okay, so we are out on our walk now and I'm going to do some curb walking, which basically is you find a curb, <laughs> you step up and then step down. So I'm gonna do my right side first and then on the way back, I'll do my left side. But apparently this is supposed to help move baby down, start dilation, I guess, so do this it's definitely not painless there's definitely pain <laughs> and lots of pressure but if it helps I'll do anything that helps so we've got our little girl sniffing everything you're doing that, so she's oh she wants to be where I am <laughs> that's so funny but we're gonna do our little walk it's usually like a mile round trip a little slower than it used to be because I walk pretty slow now, but hopefully this makes stuff happen. So we've been back from our walk for a little bit now and we just finished dinner, but we got some pineapple at the store earlier today. So I'm going to try and eat some of this pineapple, see if that helps. I'm not really that big of a pineapple person personally. It's like not like the fruit I would go to, but if it's gonna help labor, get going. Hey. We're gonna try it, and Honey is playing with our rug over there and messing it up. <laughs> so I'm gonna eat this, we're watching a movie, and then I'll probably make a tea later. So that is all the techniques that I'm going to be trying out to induce my labor. Hopefully some of them worked, we will see in the next couple of days. If I do go into labor, maybe they helped, maybe they didn't. Comment down below if you guys have tried out any of these tips in the past or if you're going to try them out, which ones have worked for you and which ones haven't, I would love to know. And let me know if there are any that I didn't try out that I definitely should because I'm ready to get this baby out and ready to meet him. So definitely give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.